Hello guys, SilverPlayer22 here bringing you another informed Silver Player review. Today we're going to be looking at Denis Yilmaz, who is a Turkish player from Bursapur. I think that's how you pronounce it. He is a very, very interesting player that we're going to look at in a moment. But thanks for again for all this support on the previous two videos that I've uploaded. As I say, this is only my third video back after a three-year hiatus. And yeah, just keep your constructive criticism coming because, uh, yeah, I feel like we, uh, we're on a journey together and we're going to continue improving the videos. And yeah, all your constructive criticism is helping me get better. So let's take a look at the in-game stats. We've got 80 pace, 78 dribbling, 76 shooting, 70 passing, and 78 physical. Those are some really, really well-rounded stats for a silver card. And if we go and have a look at the in-game stats, you can see that a very, very similar sort of uh, sort of sort of set of stats is, is going on there because they're all very, very well-rounded. I mean, look at those sort of mental and physical attributes. They are incredible, really. You've got some really really top quality stats I mean there's no dark greens on the uh, physical but overall very very well rounded shot power is obviously very high finishing is very good um, and yeah overall looking like a very top player six foot tall three star uh, sorry three star skill moves four star weak foot and yeah let's get into the clips and start talking about this guy okay so this guy started his youth career at Bayern Munich but he never actually made it into the first team I think he was on the bench a couple of times but he's a very interesting player he's, uh, he's positioning Let's start with the negatives. His positioning wasn't great. You did have to do a lot of pass it to him and then run with the ball. But thankfully, that was actually possible because he's quite quick, actually. He's not too slow. He's really, really, really strong. He's very good at the sort of strength dribbling that you're able to do. His passing was sort of... It was just okay. I'd say passing certainly wasn't his strong point, but well, that's, not, that's not something that we need to worry about too much on a striker. But when we get to things that you do need to worry about on a striker, his finishing was absolutely phenomenal. He, he was putting in goals all over the place. Head, long shot... Finishing inside the box was sublime. Really, really, really clinical finisher. Probably the most clinical silver I've used this year. And I've, as you've probably seen on my review of Andone, um, I thought he was good, but Yilmaz sort of takes it to another level. As you can see, his positives and negatives here. But just before I talk about them, or you can just read them while I talk, but this guy's similarities to Burak Yilmaz, who plays with Galatasaray, who I'm sure most of you know because he's a very well-liked player. He's a gold player. The similarities are so, so similar. It's like someone's just copy and pasted him, but giving him sort of slightly downgraded stats so he can be a silver but anyway um when we move on to the verdict i've given this guy this guy feels like a 77 to an 80 rated player really really top quality and i've actually given him eight and a half stars which is i think it's my highest review since i've come back um i am going to be changing this review system back to a, a numerical system but just for now obviously eight and a half out of ten is very 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 good i, I can't really put this guy down too much as i say the only thing is uh, his positioning wasn't fantastic but more than usable um, and certainly very, very dangerous player to use. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe and definitely tell me which... Um, obviously, I've been away for a while, so let me know which informed silvers you want me to review because I can do any of them from FIFA 16. Thanks for watching and let me know in the comments what you thought. Cheers.